Hi, good morning everyone. Welcome back to our channel ID Explorers. So here we are today at the Russell Gore Wildlife Sanctuary. So as you can see, we have parked the car here and this is the resort parking section. So they have clearly mentioned parking areas designated only for sanctuary visitors only. So if at all any other visitors park here during the odd times, then they tow the vehicle. So let's head towards the sanctuary. A good known fact is that this wildlife sanctuary is free for visitors. So there is no entrance fee, there is no parking fee, it's all free. So let's explore how is the sanctuary and is it worth the visit. They have washrooms also. Yes. Good thing is they do have washrooms. So here we have some guidelines. Here it's also mentioned no pets, quiet zone, no drones, no food or drinks, no littering, no smoking. This is the entrance. So we are at the site 2. It's called Flamingo Site 2. And Russell Khor in Arabic, it means Cape of the Creek. Well said because it, it is located at the Cape of the Creek site. So let's go and explore and see. Ah, what about the ticket prices and which season is best to visit? Of course, in Dubai, we suggest you to visit in winters. In winters, it's from 7.30 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. However, in summers, it's from 6 a.m. until 6 p.m. So we suggest you to um, visit either in the early morning or in the late evening during the sunset to get a beautiful view. Let's go. This is called Lagoon Hide. They have posted all pictures of the flamingos. There is also this binoculars through which we can see flamingos in a close-up. BB is fully capturing flamingos. Well, yes. There are these open sections through which we can view the flamingos from different angles. It looks like the flamingos are standing and asleep. <laughs> yes. Here we can see the Dubai skyline. The Dubai skyline and the wonderful, peaceful, natural habitat of the pink flamingos. It's really peaceful and not so crowded in the mornings, so we'll visit it at 8 a.m. It's better to visit either in the morning or in the late evenings before 5. So there's no time limitation. You can spend how much of time you want. Of course, <laughs> After a point of time, maybe after an hour, you might get bored because there's nothing else to do or nothing else to see except for the flamingos. So click some pictures, take photographs, take videographs, enjoy the moment, see the birds fly and we did have a good experience. Yes, indeed. <laughs> so we will display some pictures, some good moments of the flamingos. You can have a look and enjoy.
Bye. See you until next time. Bye.